Welcome to the review and two of Fimble, the Viking third person isometric troll hunting Yotan destroying action adventure game available right now for Xbox One, PS4, PC, and Nintendo Switch for the crazy high price of 30 bucks. Should you pick it up? Definitely not. Fimble takes place during the last winter before Ragnarok, which is the end of everything. You play as a badass Viking warrior that can dismember foes, chop off heads, Choose to kill or save giant ass trolls and destroy giant ass Yotans. Sounds pretty awesome, right? But Fimble the game is anything but. No amount of blood and beheadings can save this game from being a sloppy, frame dipping mess. Games like this make me wonder how they ever pass quality testing. To start, the game struggles to keep its frame rate up. It definitely needs a healthy dose of something to help it out, as Fimble stutters constantly, which makes traversal and combat tedious and nauseating. Add in loading every minute or so, enemies failing to appear, an isometric camera with Tourette's, and constant object pop in, and you're left wondering who got paid to say, hey, this game is ready to go to shells. Good job, everybody. It's a shame, too, because Viking mythology is straight up awesome, and Fimble could have been a decent game if even only a few issues I mentioned were fixed. The graphic style, while cartoony, can be nice in certain levels, and the music is actually pretty good. While there is no voice acting, the story is told through some pretty nice comic book style cutscenes and there are some choices you can make through your journey which may alter some events later on. All this is nice, but just not enough to overcome all the other crap Fimble puts you through. So Fimble gets a 3 out of 10 and a never buy. $30 for this game is an insane price to pay, but even $5 may be too much. While the backbone of a good game is there within Fimble, everything built upon it is falling apart and never should have made it past QA testing. We owe it to ourselves to avoid games like this and demand better quality and products. So remember, if you liked the review, maybe subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Till next time, keep on gaming.